We welcome back. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> welcome back to um, Cryfar Three. Cabela's Dangerous Hunts Rock Island. I did not pick up ammo. <laughs> Just run out. Oh shit! You know something I've noticed. Yuri Lowenthal is in basically everything ever as a voice actor. Who? Yuri Lowenthal. Tell me who they played. Um, actually, you probably haven't heard a lot of his roles. Um, mm -hmm. like, Yosuke from Persona 4, uh, I think Haseo from Dot Hack. Kind of cute. He has his own website. What? I googled him. I just have nothing to say. Apparently a character in Helsing. He's Matt Miller. Oh yeah. That's like the one role of his that you've actually heard. Bioshock. Really? Who? Additional voices. Oh. Still count it. He was in Winx Club. Mm. Are you saying that you watched Winx Club? No. Did you? Nope. Are you sure? He played, um, the Elder from Fallen New Vegas. The Elder. Uh, leader of the Brotherhood until you, um, usurp his throne, essentially. Ah. Optionally. Essentially, optionally. Ah, for the love of... I just want to take out everyone but the leader, so the leader is a lot easier. But then, but... Problem is, there's a heavy. Throw a Molotov. Shh. Throw a rock. I think that's literally doing nothing. No. <laughs> LMG's not going to do much more. I hate heavies so much. You gotta kill the bag with a knife, right? The target, yeah. Mm. Uh, oh, they're actually helping me by killing this guy. No, don't, don't shoot him. Well, they're dead anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Somehow I get the feeling that the only way I'm actually hurting him is headshots. This could be a while. Like how he's walking away like, oh, I pro he's probably dead now, even though he didn't fire a single shot. No he shots fired. probably died from, like, reco um, whatchamacall, thingamajig. Um... Shit. I forget what the word is. Ricochet. Ricocheting bullets. <laughs> there we go. I oh, mean, I got a headshot on it. Congrats. Nope. Nope. <laughs> it's Y, not LB, to, to quickly switch the weapons. Fire. Is that a song or. Yeah. It's all about things that were fucked up during the times of the Cold War. I can do a death from above. Yep. Hey, 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 buddy. 
Do it Ezio style. Ravioli, ravioli, you killed my family. I better keep my eyes open. Cut you, fuck up. You're dead. You're good. You're good. You're good. Yeah, 250 freaking experience, man. I don't like how enemies always have the same, like, five weapons, though. Yeah. Like, there's so many weapons in the shop. I mean, I like that they make it so you can't really unlock them super easily, but... Still. And I don't know how Death From Below works. Basically, if it's a ledge that you can climb and there's an enemy up there, you <clears> do <throat> hit the t melee button. Oh. It's like what I was thinking, like, with Assassin's Creed 2, when you're hanging up top of a... hanging on a ledge and there's a guy walking by, you just ram up, stick a hidden blade in his ass and grab him, pull him off. But... I like how if you get advanced first aid until you get field medic, you don't need syringes at all. <laughs> oh yeah, what else do... what is there in spider? Um, reload faster... Bring up iron sights and switch faster. Yeah. We've got plenty of stuff to do that'll get us skill points, so... I'm not really concerned. What I am concerned about is bear! Bears! The number one threat to this country. Bears. In hindsight, I don't know why I bothered to uh, scan it. It's worth some money. That's like 15 bucks. I would pay a lot more for bear hide. Considering how common they are on the island. Oh god. Arms are not babies. Oh god. Just everything's appearing suddenly. Oh god. Oh god, more. I like the things that just wobble by their neck. <laughs> it's like what turkeys have, right? Mm -hmm. Poor old people. <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright, is this the plane rack one, or the... Recipe one. Can't remember. Oh, it's the tablet one. Gotta find a guy's iPad? No. Hmm. Different kind of tablet there. Oh, um, were you interested in doing Assassin's Creed, like, 2 as a LP? I don't know. Because it would be even worse than this game as far as trying to do 100% minus just like random collectibles. Because there's all the viewpoints and. Dude, dude, let me tell you a thing. Assassin's Creed 2 was the first game I ever 100%ed. Well, probably not the first, but. Even all the feathers? Yeah. Why would you do that? The feathers are a bit annoying, but it's like kind of cool because you you get the whole auditory game.
Thank you so much. All right, so there are two carved tablets for this one, and one of them is kind of a no. Wait, two or three? Thought it was three. It might be three. Yeah, it's three. I remember Seamus having a lot of trouble with this one. Yeah, like I had a lot of trouble finding one particular one because it's kind of out of the way, but not really. If that makes any sense. Not really, no. If you're not paying attention, it's really annoying to find. Because it's... Go down. Like, it's... Wait, is this the, even the right one? Oh, yeah, it is. It's, like, on the ground... Um, Wait, I thought I saw it look down. Hang on. Man, we should have gotten that feet for more water breath. Water breath. Is it? No, down behind you. Down. It's like, it's like you're right on top of it. <laughs> like, I'm not even joking. I thought it was on the stairway. Nope, to the right. Well, Look on. down. First relic. Right oh. Alright, it's like right against... No, it's right on the floor. It was right in front. <clears throat> Alright, Ken. The water is too murky. Alright, stay right there. Look to the right. Left. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Thank you. Because they don't make it glow. Thank you. <laughs> the that reason this is one of the more infamous ones is because they don't glow, so it's easy to not notice them. Ken, that was painful. Frozen, frozen, hasn't frozen. All right. Um. Let's see. This one is. How do I not remember where this one is? It's like the first one you grab, normally. Normally. Oh, it's right there. Yeah, it's like, that one was the only one that didn't glow. Right, there's gonna be a couple of pirates over there, I'm pretty sure. At least they're usually... are. Evidently not this time. No, dude, I think it's almost going to be time for us to get that fourth weapon slot. Well, I'm... Not at the point where I really feel like it's necessary yet. Like, for a modern FPS, it's kind of spoiling you by giving you four. Oh, yeah. You actually get to use explosives! The one time, the one of few times that these are actually useful. Dude, plant a mine up there and get a guard to walk over to it. <laughs> Wait, why did I go up here? Oh, there's a relic right here. And a dead guy. Okay. And a bunch of bags of corn. Sacrifice, sacrifice. Oh, Italian garlic bread, you're so amazing.
You better not run me over. Up oh. on me. Fucking David. Oh, they're just scared. Thought they were gonna actually get out and shoot at me. Well, if you run them over and, like, kill them, they will attack. Trust me. You get money equivalent to buying a new map for the relics. Hey. Alright, what else what did I want to do? Not the Path of the Hunter stuff. Should we maybe clear out that area over there? Well, where does the game want me to go for the main missions? It's me to go to Bad Town, which is... Um, off your right hand. Oh yeah, we've got two quadrants. Well, not really quadrants, but two segments to clear out. Three. One, two... Oh, yeah, three. Looks like it's time to get our parkour back on. Yeah, set so three, two. You know, it's like... The puzzles... Like, there's little side puzzles that you can do. The tombs or whatever? No, the tombs... Well, yeah, those are optional, but I think. No, yeah, those are optional, but you get really good armor for it. There's one and... in, like, sequence five you can unlock with Uplay. Hmm. The auditory tomb, I think. Well, I don't know much about that, but... I think there was a murder. We, 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 we were not witnesses. W witness to what? I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't say anything about witnesses. That would be silly of me. <laughs> you're a silly person. On second thought, let us not go there. It is a silly place. But, um, the puzzles are actually a bit fun. Um, I had quite a hoop trying to figure out how to figure out all of them. And there was a few of them that even scared me because they were like really creepy. And then, ugh, thumb, ow, shit, butts. Like the, um, little side areas in this game? <clears throat> Kinda. But they're like not moving puzzles. Not like gets you walking around. It's like, it's an actual puzzle. Oh, you mean the, um, like, like the subject, whatever. Yeah. You scan okay. It. Yeah. Those are pretty fun. Um, I don't like that kind of puzzle. Unless they actually change the type based on diff, like based on different locations. Yeah, they're not all the same. Oh. And then uh, also hang glider. We. We. Do we like Batman? I won't. I only go for the ones that are black. That's still racist. That's how I like my men. Um. We. We. Plus, it's a fun story, and you get the whole like um. You know, new weapons and all that. You get Plus suffered doing Leonardo those da puzzles. What? You guys suffered doing those puzzles with the eye symbol. Um. I don't remember. It's kind of for story, but um, with each one you unlock a whole new video segment. Mm -hmm. And like when you get all the video segments, it um, unlocks a whole big video that gives quite a bit of detail into the story of Assassin's Creed. Like the overworld. Like the actual Desmond stuff. Not Desmond, but before Desmond. No, I mean like the like modern stuff. Oh, right, yeah. I know, like, um, I don't really care about Desmond's story, or the yeah, overarching I, story. I care I about the assassins. Can't care. I can't care for anyone that looks too much like Adam Sandler, either. Um, but no, like, in that's what I like about Assassin's Creed 4. You literally play as yourself. 
only... You work at Abstergo. Yeah. And Sean's even there. Still has a great ass. Trust me. I look. Wait. Who? A uh, British guy. Sarcastic. Ah. Pretty much every British guy. Sorry, that doesn't really give much insight. <laughs> Total Biscuit is more cyn cynical than sarcastic. Hmm. Thus his label, the cynical Brit. But yeah, like, um, with the takedowns, it's like, stand stand here, there's an enemy up there, you can do a takedown. It's not very useful in most situations, but there are some areas where it's useful. Yeah. Like, any spell in Skyrim. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was kidding. Magic is almost entirely terrible. Like... Because I played so much Skyrim, I completely forgot about the mysticism tree of magic. Because they hmm. lumped it all into alteration, illusion... No, they didn't even have illusion. Alteration, conjuration, destruction, and restoration. Alright, so we've got the vehicle quest. Hmm. Hold up, you got a supply drop? Let's do it. Oh. Uh, do I wanna... There's there's actually a lot of stuff in this segment, actually. Because there's that. this, a trial, and two outposts. Probably an actual side quest. Like, yeah, I like how the shot. game doesn't take its side quests, like, as an actual, like, major story thing. It's just little things. Like, man, this is a weird freaking island, is basically the gist of them. I think the next one is my favorite. Mm. With the plane wreck. Oh. Uh, <coughs> yeah. Yeah. Choked on some chili. Pepper, or... Actual chili. Actual chili. What do you think this is? Hot, hot pepper gaming? Hot pepper reviews? Is that like an actual channel? Or? It is. It's like they get famous people. Like, uh, I know Adam Markiplier Sandler. did it. No, like famous YouTube gamers. Oh. Markiplier did it. I think Ego Raptor did one. Um, quite a few people have done it. Oh. They basically get... We're in... Ran that willow. Harry Potter. You have the name of it. The Whomping oh. Willow. Whomping. I thought it was that, but then I was like, Whomping isn't a word, Silver. You're silly. I just ran over like three dangos. Get out and take the pelts. Cut your loss. <laughs> I don't need any more dingo pelts. <laughs> um, but, uh. It's loading. <laughs> <laughs> Is this happening? What? <laughs> d d d okay, I was afraid the game. That was the most... I don't even know if I can count that as a victory. It was a victory. <laughs> but I crashed my knife in Oh wait, no, this isn't the one I'm thinking of because the side quest is over here. But we, I'm pretty sure you have to do all the outposts to unlock the area's side quest. Oh. What was I saying? Um... Oh yeah. Hot pepper. And basically, I think that they, huh? they, they uh, get the person to like pick out a game they want to review, and then they eat a really hot pepper, and then they have to review it. Oh, God. I'm pretty sure at one point they had a vegan person do it, so when they ate the pepper, they refused to have the milkshake that's supposed to you know, cool it down, so they had almond milk instead, which does not help in the slightest. Ugh. That's how you figure out if a game's good, if they are willing to eat a pepper and say, oh, this is a great game. He didn't even catch on fire. I kind of don't like how you can't go prone. That is, um, like, lay down. I know. Dude, I play d and I didn't know that was a, a term used in... Oh, God. Ugh. 
Uh, I'm eating chili. <laughs> Did I just shoot Johnny Depp as Jack Sparrow? I don't know. This is the day. That's actually what I began singing when I started playing Assassin's Creed 4 and I finally got control of the ship. <laughs> this is the tale. For those who don't know, um, Jack Sparrow, The Lonely Island, and Michael Bolton, who I'd never heard of before. They they partnered with a lot of people I'd never heard of before they did the song with them. I remember. I was It was Thanksgiving, and I was watching TV, and Michael Bolton was on a commercial, I think. Huh. Like, watching him, and I was like... That's the Lonely Island guy. Wait. But, um... Who's... Yeah. Oh, there's... Get over here. I am not Scorpion. Oh god. The fire kept spreading during the cutscene. Burn, baby, burn. <laughs> it's going for Oh, dude, at the end of the jungle. Yeah. We need the Randy Savage mod. <laughs> Why? Cause. I want it to at least be a somewhat serious Skyrim playthrough, besides commentary. Wow, while MG rounds are expensive. Yeah. We're poor. I forget when we unlock more, like, weapons in the store. Like, I'm more lock un unlock more weapons that you actually own now, or...? Actually can buy. Oh. I know that you can, um, like, when you do more of the radio towers, you get more for free, but... Like, there are a lot more sniper rifles in the game. Oh god, is this, like, one that's almost, that's literally impossible to stealth? I don't know. Because you can't get to higher ground. And that's my the entire basis for s using stealth. So if I can't do that, I'm basically Aussie BF'd. What? Aussie BF'd. Well, Australian butt fucked. Yep. It's a very, um. Fruit, fruitful term. It, it's a frugal term? Fruitful. I was going more for delicate state of mind. Oh. That too. I don't even know if this is the right guy, but... up oh. He didn't detect me! Up. Oh. Um... Let's see, can I actually... Get a takedown on... If you could turn around, sir, that would be quite nice. <laughs> he can't see over the fence, evidently. Oh god, no, not autoplay. <sighs> what? It is, I went on someone's blog, and then I realized I remembered that they had that like full, really loud song autoplay. Oh god, I hate that. So I basically just defused a bomb. <laughs> Trying to figure out which tab it was open on. Yeah.
What's in a name? Sorry, your e your AI means that you literally cannot see me. <laughs> He's looking right at me. Do you have beautiful eyes? Worked out. Oh, shit. Yeah. Brody, what the fuck? Brody gets hardcore really quickly. Yeah. But it's, not, it's not like you expect any sort of realism in a Far Cry game. Hmm. <laughs> see. Wait. Um, yeah, that is the one in the little town. Bleh. Line at the end of the jungle. Uh, I get it. You'd have to be in, like, fourth grade to not get it. And or illiterate. I'm not unliterate, Ken. I love when teachers are like, you can't consider yourself well-read until you've read this, and it's like Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> so what you're saying is we have to have bad taste in <laughs> books and writings to be well-read? Welcome to Let's Play Far Cry 3. Ken makes fun of Romeo and Juliet again. Oh yeah, <laughs> we did that earlier. Mm -mm -mm. Well, it was just an example. See, that's why I like my current language teacher. He's like, alright. I know it has Lord no plot. plot. <laughs> like, have you ever read Lord of the Flies? Huh? Have you ever read Lord of the Flies? No. Well, it's about this book. I mean, fuck. It's like a group of kids who get stranded on an island, right? Yeah, and then they start, like, segregating off, and they each represent, like, a different form of government. And then they and kill the fat kid. Yeah, and they basically pretty much rape a mother pe uh, pig, in a way. Um, Literally? Anyway, with a stick. Um, anyways. Um, one of the teachers in our school was like, You know, green shows up a lot in this book, and it means something. So write down every instance where green appears, and tell us what it means. And this year my teacher brought up, Yeah, they see a lot of green, but that's because they're in the jungle. <laughs> It's just like, oh. Like last year, we had to read, um... I forgot what it was. In My Hands, which is some, like... Like some woman who was, like, helping people during the Holocaust. And it's like, oh, she uses birds a lot, and it's totally a symbol. Mark every time you see birds mentioned. Bird, bird, bird. Bird, baby, bird. <laughs> Burn baby birds. Eat baby birds. Well, oh wait, that's fable. Well, bird is the word. Oh, so fable. I tried it out. First thing I did was punch my father in the nuts. I give it an A. A plus. What are we doing? Just peering in the window with his pistol. <laughs> this is even sketchier. I like to think that the entire rifle is pretty much sticking out through the window. <laughs> and they're just trying to ignore it. You know, I always talk to him. I'm just gonna talk to her. Jason, it is so good to see you again. Did you find my husband? Was he with another woman? Nope. Oh, thank God. He's in love with a man. <laughs> <laughs> Your neck? Oh my God. Sleep 
What? I think oh, that we took that completely out of context. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that we took it completely out of context. What? Goodbye. I'm sure. What? I think you just cost the man his penis. Why can't I shoot you, you crazy person? Put a mine outside her house. <laughs> Knowing this island, I'm pretty sure that she didn't mean the relationship, Brody. Oh, there's a underwater relic. Careful of alligators. On. No, don't do that. It was literally right in front of you, Ken. It was? Yeah, to your left. Right in front oh, of you. Yep. They I really think need blind. to. I think they need to glow more underwater than uh, over water. Yeah, I'm, a I'm actually going to be going down and grabbing relics as I get closer. Yeah, things end much better for him if you talk to him instead of her. What happens? He's just like, oh... You're right, I should tell her thanks. What's more fun option? Huh? What is more fun though? Talking to him or getting his dick cut off? Considering that you have to imagine it happening if you get it cut off. True. You and take I, the car. I kind of doubt that she's going to use a clean implement for such a surgery. So they're basically going to hardcore heavy rain it, right? Wait, what? There's one part in heavy rain where um, Ethan, the father, has to cut off his own finger. Huh. And there's several supplies that you can do it with, like, you know, a machete, steak knife, um, like one of those big knives, or safety scissors. Safety? <laughs> My brother chose uh, safety scissors. Of course and then he, he broke did. halfway through. Uh. So then he had to rip the rest of it off. He was drunk, so it's okay. What, the, what do I? What am I supposed to do here? Can you blow it up? I would have a grenade do it if a Molotov didn't. Evidently it worked. Because I don't think Molotovs are as much explosives as much as they are eh. fire. Ooh, a Cuban Sky, those are worth something. <clears throat> Outside of Wait. this game. It's yeah. a cigar made with pieces of the Declaration of Independence. I'll just buy the this, these burglary tools for three hundred dollars. <laughs> half the time I don't know if you think, if you, half the time I think that you know I'm referencing something, but you don't know what. Right. Should I explain this one? Whoop. Yeah. Futurama. Mm. There was an episode where everyone in the on Earth um, got three hundred dollars for one reason or another. And so Bender's um, in a cigar shop and is like, oh, this is big. What is it? It's like, 
oh, it's a Cuban cigar made partially with parts of the Declaration of Independence. I'll give you $300 for it. No can do. Fine, I'll buy these $300 burglary, burglary tools. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, boy. Bender is all sorts of amazing. Hmm. That he is. Meanwhile, on a nearly identical right. area... <laughs> Brody. Brody. Imagine if that was a treasure chest. God! What? Where do I go for this one? Ken, you were there. And then you ran right by oh, it. Oh, it's up there. Oh, God. God. Alright. Tiger. Did you shoot it? No. Pussy. Eh. Get it. I said get it. It was a cap. I called you a pussy. Make it look like an accident. Yes, I'll have the money wired to your account. Uh, um, sorry. Um, Silver, what what state do you live in? This is uh, purely for um, personal reasons. Yeah, that's the only. Yes, place I know you're getting impatient. What? This is the only place where they can call us assholes. Got it. I'm serious. We call ourselves that. Is this because oh, of the Oh, it's like Puritan three kinds thing? of animals right in one area. What? Is this because of the whole Puritan thing? We don't like to talk about that. We said we're sorry. <laughs> Do I need, um... Buffalo for anything. Uh, for your chicken wings. Fun fact buffalo wings are not made with real buffalo. I thought buffaloes had wings. Those Pizza Hut commercials, they lied. We don't have Pizza Hut here anymore. Really? Mm hmm. They closed down. You live in the most ghetto part of Massachusetts, then, man. They don't Kinda even true. have a freaking Pizza Hut, huh? We don't have Pizza Hut, we don't have KFC. We don't have Little Caesars, technically, anymore. Well, They yeah, changed we the name, you said. Yeah. Even that place went out of business. It's kind of funny to talk about a ghetto part of Massachusetts, in my mind, but... A lot of Massachusetts is ghetto, man. It's the ghetto of the U.S. What, what do you mean, Compton? Wait, he's... oh wait. Is he in that building? In the... oh no. Actually behind the wall. Quick hand, run it up. Oh, that's a dog. Run and take out the alarms. Bird! Did, did you do something to your full clip into that? No. <clears throat> okay, because it looked like you were shooting at it for a while, and I was like, Jesus, can I think it's down? I was shooting at an enemy as well. Is this a rare hunt or. Yeah. It is. What's this one? Um, white belly tape here. Let's do it. No. Got the 
I don't even know what the tape, what this unique tape here hide is for. And I know that it's for crafting, so shut up. <laughs> Ecstasy formula. Ecstasy! Something, something lonely island. Something, something lonely island. Oh hey, I can still get the experience. Woot. And maybe 500 bucks. It's a pretty big maybe, Ken. Why do you think I said maybe? Oh, I like this one. Honk! Honk, honk! <laughs> wow, I was kind of dragging him along for a while. Look. I feel like for these, they should just give you infinite health, though. These syringes were not doing anything. Nope, nope, nope. Wrong turn. Wrong turn. I got time anyway, though. Nope. I don't even know how I got that kill. Wait, what? Really? Okay, I'm restarting that because I got stuck. Hmm. So yeah, that ice extreme last night was pretty good. Yeah, I like how you became guppy in like one room, was it? It was, um, third floor, only one devil room, became guppy. Smooth. I didn't even expect it to work out. Like, I fully expected to lose as soon as I grabbed the dead cat. Which sounds like some sort of euphemism. Grabbing the old dead cat. It works, shut up. Did I actually kill, the, to kill a guy by doing that? I'm only healing one blip from these syringes. They kind of suck. Cool guys, don't look at it. <laughs> they blow things up and then walk away. Who's got time to watch an explosion? Cool guy heroines, they got to walk too. AKA Far Cry 3, the Michael Bay edition. Oh, yeah, beat the high score. Yay. Oh, there's a there's a helicopter? Run it over. <laughs> Run over the helicopter. Oh, you have to stay in it the whole time? Oh, no, I just didn't beat up. Get the high enough score. Oh, well. But yeah, that's that one. Right, so we're probably going to end up doing all the path of the, all the unique path of the hunter stuff at once. I mean, it's definitely worth doing the normal ones too because um, you get the um, money and ex. No, you don't get experience. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah. No. I want to see a mod pack that makes the tiger roars turn into meow. But a really masculine meow. Like they're not even trying. Meow. Like, meow. <laughs> meow. Meow. <laughs> I want it. Someone make it. What? <laughs> well. Wherever we go, we fuck something up. <laughs> something. Or someone. 
Usually hey, several you some ones. One. Huh? You actually found that one. Alright, so... Might as well do the trial and then the... Go away. Hey, guy. I'm gonna save you. Hey, guy. I say... Why are you still running? Someone just shot at him. No, I shot at the bird. Dude, you're... You're okay. Sir. 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 You're, you're in good hands, sir. Sir. <gasps> you're in good hands. Brody... The force changes, Brody. Brody becomes ultra broed. Becomes a real bro. See, that's the only time I've ever actually used grenades. And... No, satchels. I've used satchels only for like, oh man, there's a car coming. Let's fuck it up. And even then, a mine would have done just fine. Yeah, but Not I a like, mine, I, though. I like knowing I have control over who lives and who dies. There is something deeply wrong with you. I love playing. Let me guess, when you played SimCity, you intentionally played with disasters? Yeah. That was a long time ago. In the Super NES one, I think that you could have, like, a giant Bowser stomping around your town. Yeah. I played, like, the really old version. The PC one? Pretty sure there was one for the Super Nintendo. Yeah. <laughs> I once I read I read a video. I saw a video about a guy who literally spent years on his town in order to like mathematically make it perfect and would last forever on its own. <laughs> really? Yeah. He took like three years to plan all of it. Let's see, frag me up. Oh dear. Dude, you should have been crouched so you could have gotten a stealth kill. Wait. Dude, just keep throwing. Dude, you gotta make it explode like you're weighing fire. I am Zuko. <laughs> because he actually threw like fireballs, totally. He totally didn't just use like streams of fire. Apparently Sean has not watched half the original series. <gasps> Sean, Sean, Sean. I think, anyway, I might have misinterpreted him. What'd he say? I think that it, he was actually just confused about Korra, though. Oh, he doesn't oh. remember anything from the original series, that's what it was. Oh, I was about to say, I'm gonna have to have a talk with him. I've never watched Korra, though. Gonna, First waiting. season was great. First season, fucking tippy top. <laughs> Frag out. Kill the helicopter. Did I actually blow up the helicopter? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, you're almost halfway there. Halfway there. Halfway there. Hey. Let's do that for the time. You can do it, Ken. You're almost like, yeah, you are more than halfway there. That's just my high score, not the thing to get the next, um, like, prize. Oh. <laughs> Throw like 20 frags whenever a helicopter appears. <laughs> I'm waiting for them to finish Korra and then put it on Netflix before I watch it. Because aren't they doing like a third season? What? Aren't they doing a third season now, or at least they put a cliffhanger at the end of season two? I'm pretty sure that they are doing another season. I believe four seasons were planned with a new villain for each one. 
Oh, I got the experience at least. So yeah, that's what it's doing. Alright. Do the radio tower next. Um, let me check out timestamp. Yeah, I think we can do the radio tower and then end the episode. Um, I'm gonna get the bow upgrade there. So now, perk-wise, my bow is maxed out, but I still need to upgrade the quiver. Are you considering having a bow as a permanent weapon? No. It's for the Path of the Hunter quests. You're buffing it up just for all of those. Trust me, I need it. I need it. I need it. Lo necesito. Lo necesito. Lo necesito. I'm assuming that they get a different voice actor for every language. I think so, but it sounded pretty good. It would be funny if that was actually Tom Kenny. Of course, I can never get my frags to go right. I can never ju correctly judge the distance I need to throw a frag. There needs to be some kind of sight you can look at. <laughs> Can't. <laughs> a frag grenade sight? Yeah, you know, you look down your arm and there's like a little ruler you made on your arm. <laughs> that seems like something out of Deus Ex. I still need to play, but I really want to... But, like, the first game is so dated that I don't have the benefit of nostalgia, and I have the, um... Net adverse effect of being used to mo the modernized human revolution. Mm. So it's really hard for me to play the original. Plus the one time I did play it, I wound up breaking my legs before I finished a level. <laughs> Which is something that actually happens. So I was act- it's like Fallout, only you actually have to crawl everywhere. Oh my god. <laughs> so I was just crawling to the end like, KILL ME! <laughs> I don't want to go back to school tomorrow. Apparently, Sean is the day off. Why? That's the thing, I don't know. Sean got last week off. I only have a half day on Wednesday. So, like, the coasts suck, and everything in between has it good. Leap of faith. Where are the zip lines? Usually there are four zip lines, not just. Ay, ay, ay. No necesito. No necesito. <laughs> uh, Alright, Ken. I think we gotta end off. Two supply drop quests. That's a first. No, we know what we have to look forward to. Yeah. So next time on Far Cry 3 with Ken and Silver, we continue making our way to Bad Town. Even though we could technically just fast travel there. But, but, Ken, Ken, don't be a butt. Oh wow, we only have three more portions of this island. Then we have the super short, um, Four. second island. One, two, oh. I was counting, like, area, not actually, like, these. You can't count. 